Today on Big Girl, Big City, Big Style, we're going to be doing the I Heart Spring Tag. So keep on watching. Hi guys, it's Amanda here. Um, I finally got the um, got all of my stuff together and I'm finally doing the I Heart Spring Tag for you guys today. So yeah, so I've got all of my things spread out here and I got my list all ready. So here we go, okay? So unfortunately, because I live in New York City right now, um, I haven't really been in the mood to do spring yet, so because it's not looking like spring outside right now. So it's pretty like rainy and cold still. I've been trying to fill my apartment with um, spring things and um, like making it feel a lot more springy. So I'm here to do the tag for you. So the first thing on the list is what is my favorite spring nail polish. So I have two and I'm actually on the hunt for some more. So yeah, so my first, the two that I actually own that are my two favorite is I bought these a couple of years ago. They're by Essie. And the first one I have is called Lilacism. And it's a really very pale um, uh, purple color. So yeah, but it's so pretty on your nails. And I love wearing this. Like It's like I probably have like half of it gone. So, I, so yeah, so that's my first one. And my second is like, I don't know who does not love this color. It's the Mint Candy Apple by Estee as well. So there it is. It's a really, again, a very, very pale green color. And you can't, this light is not giving it justice for the, how pretty this color is. So, so yeah. And I'm also, I'm still on the hunt for the, the L'Oreal Limited Edition. And so fingers crossed that I find them. So yeah. So those are my two spring nail polishes. My next um, thing on the list is what is your favorite spring lip color? So I'm trying to get a little bit more bold in my lip color because as you can see, I wear, I wear a very neutral lip. I've actually got these two colors and I'm trying to get even more bolder on what I'm getting. So I guess I just got this one just a couple weeks ago. It's by Wet n Wild. It's, um, let's see, what is it called? It is called... Within these abode walls, I believe it says. Yeah, so it's um, it's a very coral color, and I love that what it like. I love the color on your lips. Um, it doesn't stay very well on my lips, so I have to like carry it with me when I go anywhere. So it's the Mega Shield lip color, um, SPF 15. So there's the packaging. Here's what it looks like. So yeah, so this is kind of me stepping out of my little like comfort zone. And then this one I've had for a long time and I've just now gotten into like actually wearing it as because as you can see it looks very brand new. So this is the Perky Tarte um, by um, the Lip Surgeons by Tarte. So there's that. And it's, oh here let me give you a swatch. There it is. So yeah, it's still very sheer and very light and like yeah this is me stepping out of my comfort zone I'm sh oh and let me do a swatch of the other one uh there it is there we go that's a lot more bolder there we go so yeah so this is me stepping out and i know this is not a big step but it is for me so that's my favorite um lip colors as of now. All of my spring and summer clothes are still packed in boxes. So uh, the next thing on my on the list is your favorite spring dress. And because I don't have a picture or I don't have it to show you to hold up to, to show you, I do have a picture of it. So I will be attaching the picture to, um, to this video. So coming right now. The next thing also is a picture because I don't have them here because even though I can buy them because that's one great thing about New York City is you can buy flowers any time of the year, any time of the flower you ever like dream of, you can find it. So, but I don't have one here and my favorite spring tulip or spring flower as I'm like give it to you is the tulip. So I, um, so yeah, so I'm going to also post a picture as well um, um, onto this video. So here it is. So my, the next thing is I have my favorite accessory. Okay, my absolute favorite thing to do in um, spring is to like wear a like a spring dress, like a floral dress or like a flowy dress, and then wear like a jean jacket over it, and then wear like my boots. Like I don't know why, but that's one of my favorite things to wear like in spring. So um, I also love scarves. I have so many scarves; it's ridiculous. Like I, my absolute favorite scarf is not even like 
a cheap one. It's one I got at HSM that was not cheap because it's HSM. H and M. <laughs> it's like my favorite in the whole entire world. I wear this like all year round. It's like a silvery sparkly striped scarf. Yeah. And it's so comfy and so like I just love it so much. So I wear this a lot. So yeah. So maybe I'll wear it for the rest of this video. Um, and then okay this next one is not really I don't know. It's not really springy but I bought it in the attention in the attention um, to wear it in the spring with some of my like um, some of my um, shirts and, and jeans I got so yeah so this is this really pretty necklace that I got um, it's like light pink and white and gold and I just love it and I can't wait I haven't worn it yet actually yes I've worn it once and that's because I wore it was like a day that was really nice outside so I was like hey I'm gonna like maybe like just a little springy um, and I did wear it that one day so this is something I'm really looking forward to wearing for, during the spring it's I'm a fairly big long necklace girl and I love them and so this is one that I am like going to wear a lot this spring so yeah so yay okay um, the next thing is what trend are you most excited about um, this for spring and for this season I'm really into the neon like I like okay first off I love like colored skinny jeans and like wearing like like mixed matching tops with like a pair of jeans like I want to get a pair of like neon pink or neon orange or neon yellow and yeah so I'm really excited about that and I love it and so yeah so that's I wanted to like try and find some because um it's really hard to find stuff like that in my size because I am a size 14 so um but yeah so that's kind of my getting into the neon you know like bringing the 80s back I guess yeah okay so the next one is what um, what is your favorite spring candle? Okay, so as everybody did, we I went to Bath and Body Works a couple of weeks ago with excuse me when they had the um, the three the two for twenty twenty two dollars for the candle sale. So of course I picked up some new candles and. I was looking for spring scents, probably like a lot of people were, and so I picked up the two I picked up. I, the other one is downstairs. It's the spring, and this this is the one that I have here in my room, and it's called Pineapple Orchid, and it is the absolute most amazing smell. Like I've like I've it's only been a couple of weeks, and I'm already like almost halfway down, but it's just like it's just a very like fruity. And florally like combination that is just to die for and I just I can't get enough of it and I love it so much so I yeah I'm obsessed and I want to, like I will probably every time I ha go back to Bath and Body Works this will be one I buy because I just can't I wish you could smell it because it's just so it's so it's not strong it's really peaceful and like relaxing and it's just absolute to die for and yeah so yeah definitely please check this out pineapple orchid at Bath and Body Works because you will love it and yeah that's all I really have to say okay so the next thing is what is your favorite spring perfume so I it's hard for me just to pick like a spring perfume because I go every single day and I'm like what am I in the mood for today because I have my array of like perfumes that you can check out my um, perfume uh, video um, on here so yeah but like but I'd have to say the two that I do typically like go to for spring would have to be my Britney Spears fantasy because it smells like it, it has a very it's very like I think it smells like cotton candy and I think that's just so fun okay so cotton candy and sweets and like happiness is all in a bottle yeah okay so that's the best yeah cotton candy in a bottle and happiness in a bottle yeah. so check it out and a lot of people probably have this and they probably you know love it as much as I do so definitely fancy pretty spears my next one is the um, coach this is the f poppy flower um, that came out last year I think it came 2000 it came out either the beginning of the end of 2011 and beginning of 2012 maybe ish yeah and I love this stuff this scent it's very flowery but not strong 
like, I'm not really big in musk, but I think it might have a little bit of a musk to it. I know, it just makes me happy when I spray it. So this, no. Oh. Yeah, so I do love this. If you have it, check Coach. I think all of Coach's perfume smells so good. And it's actually reasonably priced, so check it out. So those are my two, like, go-to when it comes to spring scents. Um, the next thing is, where, what is spring like where you live? Well, right now it's rainy and it's possibility of snow <laughs> and it's in the 30s. Um, we've, we have been in spring for a few days now and you would never know that it is spring. Um, because right now outside my window, which is right over there, it's rainy and nasty. Um, so yeah, but typically on a normal um, situation. Um, New York Springs are very, very nice. Very, it usually is on the colder side because we are by the water. It's very windy, but it's very sunny. We do have, um, you know, uh, what is it? Um, spring showers brings, or uh, what is it? Spring showers or April showers brings May flowers. That's pretty right. Yeah. So we get a lot of rain and, um, it's a warmer rain and you know it's fun to play I think it, I don't like um, the city when it rains because it's hard when you're like trying to transport places because things get sh like shut down or like closed or something because something happened but typically it's actually not too bad I like to go out like on a day off or whatever I like to go play in the rain so um, but yeah it's actually pretty nice I love I love it because it starts the flowers start to bloom and the parks are so nice to so, like finally you get to go walk in the park and you like walk around the city and you can then start to have where the cafes have um, you can start to sit outside again and eat and have coffee or have drinks the beer gardens are finally open where you can go and you can you know like um, eat and drink outside Side and it's just a lot of fun. So, um, one thing that's really nice about New York City in this um, spring summer is the um, is the um, the festivals. We have so many great festivals here. So yeah, and the like street festivals and all that stuff. So yeah, so that's one thing that's really nice. Okay, so the next thing is what's your favorite thing about spring? Pretty much everything I just mentioned from the last thing that about like getting to eat outside and um, festivals and like it starts to get warmer and I can lay out and like get a little bit of color. Yeah, so that's probably my favorite thing. Am I a spring cleaner? I'm pretty anal when it comes to cleaning, period. I keep things pretty clean, so... I don't actually like sit down and like actually do like a major clean um but yeah but I'm but I clean I'm just not really like okay let's go and like clean now so yeah okay and then last one is are you are you planning any vacations nope don't have the money I um there's a lot of things that are happening right now with me and transitioning into it um either a new apartment or transitioning into a new city. I don't know what's going on. You can check out um, my my vlog. I talked a little bit more about that um, earlier today. So no no vacations. I really wish I would love to like go somewhere tropical or go to a beach or like go on a cruise or like something like anything really right now because I'm just like such in a rut. But no, no vacations right now. So that's my list of um, I Heart Spring tags. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I saw the video on Miss Glamorazzi's um, page and thought, hey, I should do this too. And I've seen a lot of other people starting to do it. So I hope that you also um, are doing the video. Please respond with a video response um, to it. I'm actually going to tag a couple of people on this. I saw, um, so Amy Vlogs. You're going to have to do this now, so I'm, I'm putting it up to you. Also, to Electric Buds, if you would like to do it as well, please do. And um, Tear, um, Tear Falls Break, I believe you you did a somewhat of a spring tag, but if you want to do this tag too, I would love to see it. And then um, Robin, I can't, I never can remember your your YouTube um, name, but yeah, but you know who you are. So I hope to see you guys soon, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Respond, what are some of your spring favorites? What do you love about spring? Because I know I love spring and summer. So share them with me, video response, comment below, give me a big thumbs up, and don't forget to find me on Facebook and Twitter and Instagram, okay? Talk to you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. And always remember, the best revenge is being fabulous. Bye, guys.